Hey guys, thanks so much for joining me for another video. Today I'm going to be using this Fun Stamper's Journey stamp set called Yeti Confetti. And this Bow Bunny 6x6 paper pad called Winter Getaway to make a couple cards. I'm going to start with some Express It blending card. This is my go-to um, cardstock for alcohol marker blending. This cardstock has made me much more confident and I actually see the blending results rather than making a mess like I used to. <laughs> so I'm going to start off with a couple circles. One is going to be my three and a half inch circle from the Fisker's Punch and the other one will be a two and a half inch circle. And so one I'm going to use for this big guy and one for the little guy. So like I usually do, I'm inking up this stamp with my Memento Tuxedo Black ink, only partially off screen. And then the second one I do uh, completely off screen, so I just cut that out. I always test a few markers before I start coloring just so I can get an idea of what might blend well together and what I can just um, ignore. So this darker one I put away but then I tried out quite a few more and then I started with his little horns and I just kind of color away. I end up using three grays on this little guy and then I also smash out some of the gray color from his face with a really light pink color. And it just kind of moves some of the gray out and put, puts a pink hue um, on his face.
And next, I fill in a very light blue for sky, ground, background, just to kind of fill in some color. And now I just grab a really dark bluish gray color and just draw a line around the outside of the circle. This small Yeti, I just started out with the pink and then I used a more yellow color, a yellowish brown on the cheeks and on the horns. And when I asked Eli what color a Yeti would wear if they were wearing a sweater, he said purple. So this guy wears a purple sweater. Now on to work on the card bases. This first one, I take a piece of cardstock that is four by five and a quarter, and then I cut some one inch strips from four alternating pieces of the cardstock, and just kind of put them at a little angle and line them up. And then I cut off the excess, and that is my backing piece. I layer that up on the card base and go ahead and just glue the Yeti right down onto the middle of that. For the next card base, I again uh, do some mixing and matching. Two of these strips of cardstock are two inches and the other is one and one quarter inches. I layered those with the smaller one in the middle, punched out a three and a half inch um, piece of coordinating cardstock, glued down my little Yeti, and then I stamped a sentiment on a strip that says Yeti for snow, because he's wearing a sweater and he's a Yeti. And to finish out this other card, I just stamp the sentiment, can we keep him, across the bottom. It's a little crooked, but it'll do. And then I glue some enamel, actually they're self-adhesive, <laughs> uh, 
glitter enamel dots. And then on the other one, I use three attached purple gems to match the Yeti sweater. Thank you so much for joining me for another video. I did pick up two of the Yeti Confetti stamp sets, so I am giving one away today. Please see the description below for all of the rules. And don't forget, safety first.